Hey, what's up everyone? Danny Lightning back with another CSR2 video. So a lot of people are stuck on the Dress for Success event. And a lot of people are trying to figure out how do I add more stars to my car? So this is something that only applies to Elite Customs cars and the Elite Tuners. Most cars you cannot add extra stars, but if you're on one of these Elite Customs cars and you click up here on the top where it says Elite, all right, click on that. You're going to see these upgrades. Now you've got green tokens over here, you got blue tokens, you got uh, pink tokens, and you've got gold tokens. This is what it requires to add the more stars. Now if you'll notice on this car, as I do these upgrades by adding these tokens onto the car and upgrading the level, once I hit level 15, that added three stars to my car. I went from zero stars to three stars when I hit level 15. Once I can get up to level 25, hey, if I can hit Elite, elite Customs level 25, it's going to give me the fourth star that I need. All right, if I can hit Elite Customs level 20, level 30, it's going to give me the fifth star. And if I go all the way to 35, it's going to make this car have five purple stars which is going to give it a, a live racing boost every time you win a live race you're going to get a little bit of extra rp for the for the purple stars now four star cars and five star cars get the same amount of rp i've noticed but once you get a car that has four or five stars it gets a, an additional rp boost plus add the purple stars onto that and that's another boost okay so everybody who's can't figure out how to add more stars to your car you've got to collect all these tokens now you can buy these okay now if you if you click on the green tokens you can buy green tokens you can get 100 for 50 gold all right you can buy 100 tokens for 50 gold and every time you buy that the price goes up so the next 100 is going to cost you 60 then the next 100 is going to cost you 70 so every time you buy it the price goes up and every 24 hours it resets so right now, if I were to buy this with 50 gold and add 100 tokens, in 24 hours, it would reset back to 50 gold. All right? Now, a lot of people don't know how to earn these tokens, so we're going to go talk about how to get these tokens. It's actually really, really easy, but it does take a very long time. All right? I've been saving these tokens for months. Months. Okay? Ever since this thing started, that's why I have so many of the blue, pink, and uh, gold tokens. Now, I've only got 375 of the green because I keep spending these things. Every time I get greens, I spend them. But I've barely spent any any at all as far as the blue and the pink and the gold. I, I don't normally upgrade cars on Elite Customs because I don't care too much about it. But the Supra is one I actually do care about. So my goal is to max this Supra out. So let's go talk about how to earn these tokens. All right, every day come out to your map. Every day, come out to your map. Right now, we have something called a fusion trial. All right, you click on that guy. Look at this. You do 15 races, and you're going to get all these green tokens. Now, you can make green tokens into blue, or you can make blue into, into uh, pink, and you can make pink into gold, I think. I can't remember, but you can fuse them. Now, unfortunately, you, you can't make anything into green. You can only earn green from stuff like this. But there's going to be all kinds of things all over the map that gives out the green tokens, guys. And this is one of them. This is a new thing. There's going to be new little events all over the board. You know, every day, come out here and check your map to see if there's something that's giving away the tokens. Now, another huge thing is your showdown races, guys. Showdown. Let's go ahead and click on this showdown, which hasn't been started yet. So, look at this. If you do 10 races, win or lose, it doesn't matter. This first set of prizes right here, it doesn't matter if you win the races or lose the races. All you have to do is complete 10 races, and you're going to get 500 uh, green tokens. Do 20 races, you're going to get 600. Do 50 races, they're going to give you another 700. Once you hit race number 70, you're going to get 800. Once you hit race number 100, they're going to give you 900 of these. Race 130, you're going to get a 1,000. That's a lot of tokens. Race 200, another 1,000. Race 220, 1,000. Race 250, I mean, look at this. There's tokens everywhere. There, there's pink ones, there's blue ones, there's green ones. Plus, if you come over here, 
Now, when you win races, you're going to get additional, you know, when you hit 400 trophies, you're going to get 500 tokens. When you hit 500, 700 trophies, you're going to get another 500. All right, this game gives out stuff like crazy if you can do these events, okay? So these are how you get these tokens, guys. Showdowns are huge for giving you tokens. Even if your car sucks, you can at least get this first set just by completing X amount of races. And then if your car is good, you can continue to get more and more and more tokens from these prizes here. Now the actual event, Dress to Impress, you can't see the old prizes because I've already finished them, but this had this gave away a lot of green tokens. Green tokens galore, guys. I earned so many tokens from this, it wasn't even funny. And that's how I got my super up to the level it's at right now, was just by running this dress to impress. But once I hit race number 30, all right, I can't go any further until I add a fourth star to my car. So I'm stuck. Most people are stuck. This is not something that's meant to get through really, really quickly. So now I just got to collect those green tokens until I can get enough to add that extra star. All right, so you do have to have four stars to complete Dress to Impress. Now, there's something over here called Dress to Impress Evolution. You're going to have to have the car 100% maxed out on Elite Customs. I don't know if you need the purple stars, but you at least need to have five stars. So you got to have it at least almost maxed out, okay? You got to have five stars on the Supra to beat Dress to Impress Evolution. The regular Dress to Impress, you have to have four stars to complete it. If you don't, you're just going to have to save your tokens. Now, there is something over here called the Event Hub. Click on the Event Hub and go over to your event shop. Now, I already spent like 400 or 600 of these tickets. When you run that Dress to Impress thing, it's going to give you tokens, guys. And you can use those tokens to buy things. And there was there was a, another set of green green Elite tokens right here. I already bought them, so they've disappeared. Unfortunately... There isn't anything else up there, but right now I have 600 of these tokens to buy something else. There's nothing in here that I want to buy for 600, so I'm just going to save those tokens for a while. But there's all kinds of ways to get these green tokens, guys. All kinds of ways. All kinds of ways. All right. Um, this duality cup up here is giving away tokens. All right. On race number eight, you get 500 tokens. So pretty much any event that pops up on the map, make sure you check it out because there's a pretty good chance it's going to give away at least some tokens, okay? This one's giving away a bunch of tokens if you can finish it. I don't have either one of these cars upgraded, so I'm not going to do the Duality Cup because I'm not going to dump 6 million game cash into one car and 6 million into the other just so I can do an event. That's about how much it costs to upgrade a Tier 5 car to Stage 5. Very, very expensive, but there's just going to be stuff all over these maps, all right? Make sure you check check it all out. Let's look at the Prestige Cup. Let's see if that, this gives out anything. Uh, no tokens on this, okay? So not every race on the game gives out... Not every race on the game gives out tokens, but a lot of them do. So make sure you guys check these out, especially Showdowns. All right, just remember, there's going to be more cars after the Supra with events like this popping up. There's going to be several of these things, okay? So this is going to be like a huge ongoing event that's here to stay. And it's going to take forever to get through all this. It's like Legends or it's like Tempest or something, all right? It's something you've got to work through. you got to be patient. Take your time. Don't try to rush through it. But uh, you're going to get all kinds of cool stuff from these events, guys. All kinds of cool stuff. All right, so once the King of the Mod Stars event opens, we're going to have this Nissan Skyline. All right, we're going to have this 2000 or this GTR R34 Skyline as one of these cars. Another one, check this out. The 2017 Nissan R35 GTR, whatever. This is also going to be one of these Elite Customs cars where you can upgrade like this. You click on Elite, it's going to show you there's all kinds of stuff you can do. I mean, these are going to be, you're going to get body kits. And there's, there's probably going to be events for this, okay? It looks like you're going to need both of these. You're probably going to need one of these for part of King of the Mod Stars. And you're probably going to need the other one for the other events. So 
it's going to be a lot of upgrading, a lot of collecting tokens, and there's going to be more of these Elite Customs tuners coming soon. The ones in the crates, all right, there's going to be a whole bunch of these coming out. So it's going to be, uh, it's going to be pretty crazy. All right, that's a lot of cars to upgrade, guys. A lot of cars to upgrade. Some of these are Tier 5. Of course, the Tier 5 ones probably cost a little more, but anyways... I think that pretty much wraps this video up and I will catch you guys later. Hope it helped. See ya.